The majority of us hide or burn the bridges we cross to achieve our objectives. That, however, is not the case with Kim Kardashian as she shares her first photo shoot on Instagram. Let's take a look at it. Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. For this video, we will take a look at Kim Kardashian's jaw-dropping picture from her first photo shoot. But before anything else, please leave a like on the video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell down below so you won't miss our videos. Without any further ado, let's hop on right to the video. Kim Kardashian isn't one of those celebrities who keeps their early steps to fame locked away in a forgotten memory box. Instead, she posts it on her Instagram feed, causing the rest of the world to be in awe of her. Kim Kardashian released a photo from her first photo shoot this time. Along with this, Kim Kardashian wrote in the caption, my first photo shoot ever. Kim Kardashian's mother, Kris Jenner, took the words out of our mouth when she commented, you are such a cutie, and added a heart face. This is not the first time that Kim posted a throwback picture of herself. Kim Kardashian had previously released a video of herself from 2001. She is seen on the beach in a bikini. She took the internet by storm and these photographs with messy hair and a rebellious expression on her face. In the caption, Kim Kardashian wrote, Little K, copyright 2001. Little K looked cute indeed in these snaps from her younger days. Throwback photos abound on Kim Kardashian's Instagram feed. Kim Kardashian left a stream of vintage and current photos of her grandmother Mary Jo, or MJ, when it was time to wish her an 87th birthday. Kim Kardashian poses with all her children with MJ and a few photos. The album also includes a shot of Kim Kardashian, Kris Jenner, and MJ standing together during a photo shoot. She wrote with the caption, Happy 87th birthday, MJ. You are the woman who taught me my work ethic and have taught me so much about life, love, and relationships. I'm so grateful to have you by my side to always go to when I need someone to keep it all the way real with me. I love you so much and hope today is magical for you, Grandma. I love you so much. Kim Kardashian understands how to praise herself on the back by posting her first photo shoot, but she also appreciates her family and cousins. When Kim Kardashian's cousin Cece was finally declared cancer-free, the reality star took to Instagram to express her gratitude. Kardashian also updated a photo of herself and Cece sitting together on a date one evening. She posted with a caption, this is an at Cece Busi appreciation post. I found this pic from a trip to Mexico we took and just reminded me of what an amazing strong cousin I have, so wanted to share. She is officially cancer free after a few decades battle. So proud of her. Cece's mom and my dad's mom were sisters, so I love going on walks reminiscing about all of the fun stories. She's just the best. I love you Cece. It seems like the reality TV star has been contemplating a lot by checking out her photos from the past. It seems like this is her coping mechanism on how she and Kanye divorced and how she realized that she wants to spend the majority of her time being joyful. During the final episode of the 20th season of Keeping Up With The Kardashians, Kim revealed that she had been going to counseling to improve herself. Kim was absolutely opposed to therapy, arguing that she was a rational person who didn't need it. Kim goes on to state that turning 40 taught her that most of the time she wanted to be joyful. She said, I feel like I've worked so hard in life to achieve everything that I've wanted to, and I've lived up to my expectations and achieved 10 times more than I even thought was humanly possible. But it appears that her life of extravagance cannot be stopped anymore since just this April she was declared a billionaire by Forbes. Kardashian West's net worth has risen to $1 billion, up from $780 million in October, thanks to two profitable businesses, KKW Beauty and Skims, as well as cash from reality television and endorsement deals, as well as a number of smaller ventures according to Forbes. Following the success of her half-sister Kylie Jenner's Kylie Cosmetics, Kardashian West launched KKW Beauty in 2017. She took a page from Kylie's book and used a direct-to-consumer approach that mainly relied on social media marketing. 
Her initial introduction of 300,000 contour kits sold out in less than two hours. By 2018, the company had grown into eyeshadows, concealers, lipsticks, and fragrances, and had sales of around $100 million. Last year, she reaped the benefits of her ownership when she sold 20% of KKW Beauty to cosmetics multinational Cody for $200 million, valuing the company at $1 billion. While Forbes believes the amount is inflated, Cody, which also bought 51% of Kylie Cosmetics in 2020, is infamous for overpaying. Her remaining 72% ownership is still valued at around $500 million. That's it for today. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you never miss out on any future content we'll produce for you guys. We're signing off now, but we will be sure to catch you all in the next one.